So to the beach, Terrell, Brandon, Sean, my QBQ, Uzuma, come on Uzi, Uzi, so, so some of them not getting in, but some of us are, we might as well take our shoes off now, so, I'm gonna do that now, take my shoes off. Shoes are off now. Beach. Oh, this ain't soft, fam. I should have. This is not. I should have went barefoot. Yeah. How you feeling? Nice and hot. <laughs> so we're almost there yet. Not yet. <laughs> he said he better use the speedos. <laughs> what's this? What's going on? Are those pigeons? Oh no. I don't know what these pigeons are doing, but they already uh, black people with the projects down here. Bro, you gotta say, in the winter, they're in the last Look at this. Get them that cold. The pigeons are the, uh, the ghetto black people <laughs> down here in Florida. <laughs> I'm hopping in there. I'm going right in there. I'm going right in. I said I wasn't going to get in. Why not? Just get in for a little bit and then dry off the rest of the time. Look at they not getting in the wood. Put that camera up, bro. Nice. Journey to the beach begins now. Look at him. <laughs> Going into the water, ocean blue. Fan, this water is freezing, Miami. <laughs> oh, yeah. let's go. Yeah, I'm in there, baby. Let's go in there. Oh, that's not a jellyfish. Pretty sure. Is it a jellyfish? Huh? Oh, am I stepping on him? That's not a real jellyfish, is it? Look at this. Jellyfish washed up on shore. Oh. Jellyfish. Huh? Don't out the So it's huh? cold as hell. Uh... <laughs> it's beautiful out there, baby. I'm about to go surfing. Oh, y'all never seen me surf before, huh? Yeah. Yeah. I surfed the hell out. These waves too small for me, though. I learned how to snowboard and my friends were like, why don't you come surfing with us? And I learned how to surf. It's already recorded. This is walking out to the beach. No deeper than this. We're coming out here too. We're not gonna leave here than this. It's freezing. That's it. That's it. It's too high. The water getting too high for me. 
You're not going no deeper than this. This is it. Now we're going to meditate on things. So tell me what you think about life. Tell me about something. What's one of your dreams and goals? <laughs> Million dollar network. I like. It. Let's go. Brandon, dreams and goals, Brandon. Financial independence, escaping that 45. So Rob, I'm doing dreams and goals. What's dreams and goals? My dreams and goals. One of my biggest goals is to retire by the time I'm 25. Well, not retire. Be financially independent by the time I'm 25. So I never had to work for another human being again in my life. Oh, nice. Long term goals is to uh, make a lot of people financially free. Retire my dad, who, you know, <laughs> worked so hard for me and my family. Um, you know, just make an impact in this world, keep a legacy behind. Um, yeah, man, just be happy. Be happy. Happiness. That's all I want to be in life. Just be happy. Happiness is king. Nice. So, as you team, we got more team members that have the dream to go for two more. Uh, I'm gonna put the phone away for a second. Uh, it's not recording. And we'll do the gyms and goals up there in a second. We're here with a uh, final member, Usman. Usman, Usman, sorry, Usman. And he's gonna talk about his goals. So, Usman, what are some of your goals? Alright, cool, man. It's kind of sunny out here. I don't know if you can see it like that, but uh, just moving forward, because like what we do, like we project our goal from month to month basis. So, when you come to the business goal, my goal is honestly just to have 10 follow up go through. So, what does that mean? It's like you sit down with people, like you're exposing the business first. If it's for them, it's great. If it's not, they, they possibly need to other people as well. So, what I mean, like 10 follow up, meaning it's like, okay, a lot of times what we do is like, we show the plan, show the plan. You know, people might be interested in what happened, like sometimes it might fall to the ground. So, once you have like 10 follow up, that means like, you follow them. Like, like, you get the number of what about long term? Like, um, like lifestyle long term? Lifestyle, lifestyle long term. Absolutely. Like, we like, you know, always talk about, like, you gotta set your goals. Like, my lifestyle long term is, like, going back to Africa because I have, like, uh, close to, like, six, if I, if I believe, like, four to six hundred plus cousins and family members that I have, I have a hundred, I came from, like, a large family, so my goal is, like, to make kind of everybody from my family. And I have some family and friends, some, some family members in Spain, some family in England, hopefully, like, so I have a lot of cousins that I never had the opportunity to the blood's thicker than water. And also, too, it's like visit a couple countries. It's like some extra countries. I have a lot of cousins that I never had the opportunity to visit. And also, too, it's like to have, I want to open up a hotel in my country. Like, the price of owning a home in America is like roughly equal to owning a hotel in Africa. So if I go to like own a hotel and like a tourist in Milan, I would charge them. Cool beans, Us Usman. Got it. So that was Usman talking about his goals. Uh, Usman's an, uh, an entrepreneur. So we earlier talked about you know, being with a business. We have some shades so you can see me a little better. So we talked about uh, with his business, uh, basically, uh, you know, his business is for a potential client uh, you know, as far as with, you know, health in the long term. You know, back. So that's like, uh, so we got to keep down here to like, the gym with, you know, uh, beach workout. Uh, there's a little beach workout earlier, but I, I didn't record it on my phone, so hopefully I can get that for you guys. Uh, we have my down here in Miami, uh, talking to some of the guys, what their goals are, you know, you know what they're going to do. So uh, we're going to wrap it up here um, pretty soon. You know, uh, I might do a little more recording about the combo to wrap it up and show you some food that we eat afterwards. With uh, Josh, and uh, we're gonna talk about. He's gonna tell us about what his goal is. Like I don't know, like, it's like ten years from there, where do you want to be, basically, yeah. something like that. Well, in about ten years, I see myself being pretty much financially free. Uh, by how I you know, finance my money, how I you know, take the business serious, and uh, my two goals that I'm after right now is completing a doctrine in uh, management leadership. 
Yeah. Yeah. Nice. So those are his long-term goals. Obviously, a lot of brothers out here doing a lot of big things. <laughs> Watch out, we're coming up. So uh, that's. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> so, uh, but we're gonna go get food soon. So I'll show you some of the healthy food to eat down here in Miami, um, and we'll go from there. Put the blinders on. Put the blinders on. Put the blinders on. People tell you no, what do you say? This is gonna be doubters. Yeah. <laughs> Negative energy, shoot it out, get rid of it. Alright, you gonna do it at night. Come on. I'm not worried about that. Alright, let's let's be out. Alright, I'm out. At this place outside the Fritz. Oh, it's called the Fritz Cafe. Uh so let me see what we're gonna order. I ordered something called the Cuban sandwich, but I'm gonna see if I can find it now. That's what I do, brother. There's a lot of good stuff, but I'm just gonna show you. Right there. So, that's the Cuban sandwich, uh, doesn't that much, it seems kind of healthy, um, so I'm going to show you, check it out, uh, we're going to see it come out, so, so Miami Cuban sandwich, Let's see how it is. It came out, and this is what we got. Fries aren't the greatest for health, but the Cuban fed sandwich, Cuban sandwich we got. Meat, bread, cheese, and some ketchup. Um, so that's what we're eating today. We're gonna go ahead and finish that off, polish it off. It's pretty good. I'm sure. A little cheat day. Well, uh, just wear my hand. Finish it and we'll get back. We long. It's all done. Use a little fork to pick my two. So. Uh, yeah, so we're done now. It's pretty good, not bad. Nine dollars, so not a whole bunch. It's Miami, what do you expect? So we're gonna go take a walk around the travel. Uh, a little bit up down the uh, beach. Uh, meet up with some more friends. So yeah, so we're gonna meet up with some more friends. Keep it going. I'm gonna move again. Uh, Walking towards, uh, then we have some other people, so we're done eating. I'm a little full, not quite as much as I wanted to be, but it's better than nothing. A bunch of beautiful people out here, but what did you expect in Miami? Full of beautiful people. Now nah, they have me out here. <laughs> Let me stop, but uh, it's oh my lord. All right, I see this ring set, and I'm thinking I'm, I'm wanting to go there. Just give me a second, I'm gonna show you this guy. Ten arm swings, ten pull ups on a pull up ring. Mm. Alright, stop it. Five with fingers, five fingers, all the way down to one finger. I did it once, I'm trying to do it again. Five finger pull up first. Pretty easy. Four finger. Here we go. One. Woo! Get some sand. Let's 
it's gonna be hard. <laughs> Let's see. Woo. No, I don't think I got that. No, no, no. <laughs> so, <laughs> two fingers. Let's go. guys I'm gonna try and do a muscle up now the right way I've been slipping so I'm trying to do both arms my arms getting tired I bet you you cannot do it here. but I'll do it ready Competition done now. Beach gym. Nice. Nice. Lots of good athletes out here. We're gonna leave now, play some volleyball because we need to get some cardio in. That would be fun, but there's a lot of good athletes out here working out. Getting it in. Yeah. Now we're going over there to the course, the ball up. In volleyball now it was good it was fun oh hold on hold on Terrell I forgot my uh my other ring hold on so we leaving volleyball it was fun we played it was good so we're gonna go back hop to the beach uh go back to the hotel charge the phone so day workouts done I'm nice and sweaty got a nice little workout in so we'll see you uh later Just finishing up here in Miami, South Beach, Florida. They're shooting a TV show down here, so I had to sign a waiver. That was that was about just to say I have to be on there, so that's perfect. But um, yeah, so I'll be traveling. Um, I'll be going to where are we going? Ocean City, where's that? Maryland. So I'll be in Maryland uh, in a couple months, and then in Vegas later in the summer. So if I'm coming near you, I'll let you know. We'll work out. But uh, don't forget to subscribe, click the notifications bell, and we'll see you next time.